This is your one and only FireSpark81 with your daily dose of video goodness and welcome back to another exciting cyberpunk video. Today, we're going to talk about how you're missing out on EXP if you're trying to level blades. Let's get to it. So before we jump into this video, I got to give a massive shout out to WAC4863, good friend of mine, also a YouTuber. I'm going to link his channel down in the description. He is the one who found this. So make sure you go over there and check out his channel. He covers all kinds of different video games, mostly survival stuff, but all kinds of different survival games. So the situation with this, it happens when you do a finishing move. So if you do a finishing move with blades, you don't get any experience from for leveling blades at all. If you take a look here, I've got plenty of room to grow for... Nope, that's assault. We want blades. I'm only level four. We're at 1935 right now. I'm going to show you this with the mantis blades first because they're the easiest ones to show you with. If you do the mantis blades finishing move, you will not get any blades experience. So we're just going to come over here. We're going to leap at this guy. Or maybe not. Let's try again. We're going to leap at this guy. Now, we're going to get it because I killed him normal. For some reason, it did not do the, the thing there. And you can see we got Blades experience. Let's try to reset him and get it to actually proc the thing. All right, the other dude's being a bit of a pain in my butt. So we're going to try these people here. So if you take a look at our Blades, we're at uh, 697 right now. So let's see if we can pull this off with just one of these. We're going to hit one and then run. There we go. Okay, so we killed them, and now we're just going to run away. Now remember, we were at 697, so we got to run pretty far to get out of the combat there. If we run down, well, not too far, just to the end of the road here, they'll reset. Well, okay, so there they are. So we were at 697. If we go back over here to our blades, we are still at 697. So we did not get any experience for that kill because we procced that that animation that um i don't know whatever you want to call it so any other kill will get you experience it's only when you do the finishing move so if we go to one of these here there we go and you'll see that we did not get any experience i'm going to run out of combat it should pop up and tell us that we got experience and it won't so it also happens on katanas when you do the katana finishing move. And I'm just going to insert a clip here because I was having problems getting this to proc on my character because I'm so high level, it just one shots everything. But essentially what happens is if, if your strike is going to kill them and they're already low health and the final strike will kill them, you go into a animation, a special animation, just like you do with the mantis blades. When you do that, you do not gain any experience either. When you're end level, end game, it's not it's not a situation where you're going to do that very often because you're just pretty much going to one shot everything. However, every other point in the game when you're trying to level these things, you're probably going to be doing that a lot. And when you do that, you're actually missing out on getting any experience. So the way around that is just don't do the heavy strikes. It's the heavy strikes that, that cause that to happen. If you only perform light strikes, you won't trigger that animation and in return you will get experience so it only happens when you do the heavy animation same thing with the mantis blades if i come up to this guy and i don't do the charge jump if i just come up to him and i just hit him with a normal light attack i will get the experience from it you can see there i just got the blade experience you only do the Mantis Blade animation when you do the charge jump, when you do that leap. If you don't do that leap, if you just come up and just do a normal attack, you won't have that problem. Or if you block and you do the backwards attack, any of that other stuff won't, won't trigger the animation. So when you're trying to level blades, if you want to maximize your experience, do not be doing those animation combos with those heavy attacks. All right, that's it for this one. Like I said, this was just a quick PSA. I just wanted to make people aware that this was a bug and it could be affecting how quickly you are leveling, especially if you're pulling that off a lot, which when Wack was showing me this, he was doing it with no problem whatsoever and actually was having situations where he was doing it unintentionally, like he was trying not to do it and still doing 
doing it. So just avoid the heavy attack if you're trying to level Mantis Blade, if you're trying to level Blades in general, whether you're using the Mantis Blades or you're using the Katana. Okay, if you found this video helpful, consider hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload other videos. And I don't just upload cyberpunk content, I upload content for all kinds of different video games. So you never know when I'm going to be uploading a guide for a game you may be playing. All right, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. If you like what you saw, consider hitting that sub button. I want to give a big thank you to my patrons for making this episode possible. You are absolutely amazing people. If you'd like to join my league crew of Patreon supporters, please check out the link in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. If you're shy, you don't like to comment, just hit that thumbs up button and share your support. Until next time, thanks for watching.